Um, Peter, we've got yeah. more Soul Calibur 5 happening, right? Or not 5, but Soul Calibur. Yeah, it's the original Soul Calibur. Uh, Namco ported it to iOS. Uh, you've got to have either iPad 2 or the iPhone 4. Okay. And this is a, supposed to be a faithful recreation of the Dreamcast version. And it's pretty close, uh, aside from the fact that there is no versus mode. Ooh. <laughs> uh, it's kind of one player. Okay. And obviously the touch controls. It might get a little cramped if you were trying to get two people to cry around <laughs> the iPad. Like, I'm going to use this top half of the screen and you use the bottom half of the screen. That could get tricky. It's a little tricky. So everything looks to be at a higher resolution than the original Dreamcast version. Okay. Um, people remember the Dreamcast had a VGA option. So it's quite possible these are all from that version. And this is just sort of like enabled on the higher res screen. Um, so you know, frame rate wise, everything looks pretty good. Uh, the game plays. Surprisingly better than you, you know than you'd expect. I know. I, I expected. I got to play this a little bit before the uh, before the show started, and I expected the worst from like the digital, the digital yeah, thumbstick that you're using um, there. Generally, I despise virtual controllers because they are just almost universally terrible. <laughs> Um, but you're, you're, you're actually telling me that this one is not absolutely terrible? It's not too bad, and I think that has to do with the fact that there's a lot of limited movement. Okay. Um, you know, the stick responds well enough, and, you know, that, that kind of handles it. The buttons themselves work fine, um, and there's a responsiveness. Well, so, I, you know, in, the, uh, in the Soul Calibur games, you're not doing a lot of the, the complex motions with the, uh, the stick that you're doing in, say, a Street Fighter game, where you're trying to yeah. do, like, a zigzag, or you're trying to do half circles and full circles. At the most, it's, like, up and down, or yeah. back and forth. Yeah, yeah Soul Calibur, you, you just sort of point it in a direction and hit one of the attack buttons. Now, the big controversy here is has had this game on Xbox Live Arcade right. for a little while. Some amount of time. Yeah, and it's being sold for $10, and that's like the full version of the game. This one is on sale for 12 but will retail for 15 huh. uh, which is high that for... Seems, yeah, that seems odd. And I would yeah. assume that the cheaper Xbox version has versus. Exactly, yeah. Um, you know, so especially for something on the App Store, too, that price is a little uh, prohibitive for a lot of customers. Um, that being said, it is a you know a pretty full game that might be worth the cost to you know to fans of the series. Um, Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. Uh, we've got a user question. They're wondering how difficult is it to pull off some of the trickier moves in the game. Trickier moves. Well, uh, I guess that's kind of you know, subjective, but you know, like I was saying, the stick is really responsive. Um, when it comes down to it. You're not really finding yourself, you know, inputting a command and having it not work. Uh, everything I'm trying to do works uh, as I'd expect it to. And granted, I'm not the best Soul Calibur player out there, um, but that being said, I played a lot of this game, and it feels pretty faithful. All right. Cool. Yeah. I'm, I'm not entirely familiar. Is there any sort of gamepad that you could hook up to the iPad? Well, there's the iCade thing, uh, which oh, is sort yeah, of like the little joystick. Yeah, but this doesn't support that yet. Oh. Um, for the more tech-savvy users out there, there are ways to sort of pair Bluetooth controllers with the iPad, uh, but we've not done that with this game, and I can't really speak to that, and I think it's against the terms of service to do that. <laughs> so, oh, there you go. So, yeah. Uh, long story short, no, there's not. All right. Mm, not yet. Not yet. Okay. Um, all right, cool. So that was our look at Soul Calibur on the iPad.